Alright, so I've got everything up and running, not that it mattered much anyway whether my internet was working or not, unless I was uploading these, which I'm not, I'm recording them now, so for later, it would be beneficial, but for now, not quite so much. Oh, Fishing Boo, I hate you. Oh, you were such a bitch. Look at that, this is annoying. That is the worst. This is stupid. I hate you, Nintendo. Oh god. Okay, woo. It's kinda close there. Oh, you game. Fishing Boo only pops up maybe once or twice, I think. But he's annoying every time. It doesn't matter. He's just annoying as hell. That's pretty much all there is to it. Alright, what is this? Free life or a vine? Damn it, a free- Oh, come on! Oh, yeah, okay. Shenanigans! What is this shenanigans and bullcrap? Oh, look, what? Come on, I need at least one of you. Stupid turn to stone ghost. Come on, let's go. I'm gonna have all day. Especially with this thing riding my ass over here. Come on. Let's get you a little bit higher. Get you a little bit higher. Come on. Come on up here. Oh, gotcha. Stupid ghost. Come on. Thank you. And it's the end of Shaco Ghost House. All but a minute and 30 something seconds. Outstanding. Alright, now we move into some of the better levels of Choco Land. This one, which is Chocolate Island 2. Chocolate Island would be, look at it, everything's all Choco. The ground's all Choco. Here the coins you collect or the time remaining can change your progress. Can you find the special goal? I can't remember what the, uh... The stipulations of each level are, but... It changes basically based on how much time you have left and how many coins you have, just like the, you know, box told you 12 seconds ago. And there's one place with, uh, I think a bunch of chucks. I think that's the secret goal. I think this might actually be it. Yep, this is probably it. And there's a bunch of these things. I believe this is the special goal. I cannot remember for the life of me, though. Alright, sorry, Yoshi, you're dead. Yeah, this is a special goal. Really didn't want to do that, but okay, we can skip half the world this way. And I really don't think I want to. So let's check what's in here. Oh, hey, we can do this chocolate secret, though. Which we will do. Boom. It's funny in my Call of Duty video, I was looking at some of the comments, and I think people thought I was trying to reference Die Hard with the Yippie Kaye motherfuckers uh, quote. Or I said hip hip hooray motherfuckers, and I guess a bunch of people were like, "It's Yippie Kaye." I was like, "Wait a minute!" Oh, the Die Hard quote. Yeah, I totally wasn't referencing that. Definitely wasn't, and didn't even think about it. So for all of you who saw that or heard that, for that matter, I was not trying to reference Die Hard at all. And if I was, then it would have been a spoof. Because I definitely know that he did not say hip hip hooray. Not in the uh, uncut version, at least. Hip hip hooray, you jerk faces! I'm Bruce Willis in Die Hard. The uh, rated PG-13 edition. God, those movies are so bad when they're, like, chopped up and edited. Like, half the movie's gone because there's violence, and then, I mean, the mouth uh, audio is all off because they always replace it with something stupid. It's really, uh, I haven't seen one of those in a long time, mainly because I don't watch, like, TBS movies or Fox movies when they have uh, the cut versions on, which... I'll take a pass on the cut versions. Uh, gotcha. It's always really fun. I used to watch those when I was, you know, a lot younger. Or I'd just randomly see them and laugh at how kind of bad they came off. But I guess uh, if you want to market to families who don't like 
that type of stuff, but... Oh, damn it. Uh, aw. Mm -mm -mm. There. Yes! Gotcha! One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Almost had uh, a full thing there. Too bad that dumbass mushroom got in the way. And by doing this, we basically skipped half of the world, which we won't be doing. This is not going to be a 100% run. This is just getting to the boss. But I'm trying to not skip a ton of stuff. I actually think I'm going to go back and do the Star Road. Come to, come to mention it. I would like to do the Star Road. Actually, after this, I probably will do the Star Road. So for now, uh, I'm going to speed this up. Simply because of the time. Oh, okay, no. That is definitely a mistake on my part. I did not want to kill myself. You know, sometimes I gotta take the rewind on some stuff that uh, I didn't mean to do. Like, kill myself when I was fast-forwarding. So there are some exception exceptions to that uh, no save state rule. Now, hold I'm just gonna speed it up a little bit more. This is a luxury I did not have in the original game. See, I don't, I don't know the exact time needed to get to this or something different than the stupid Chuck thing. But, uh, you know, why, why contest it? Might as well just speed stuff up as fast as we can. There's a bunch of dinosaur guys there. And that's it. Now where will I go to get the star? And that opens up that. So, actually I'm just going to keep going on this way until we get to the end of the video. And then off screen I'm just going to go back and uh, I'll get to a star point. And then I'll just continue on from there just to not waste time. Now, I could take that blue shell and just fly through the entire level, but... Or I can just do that and fly through the entire level. Oh, that's convenient. So is that. Um, alright. Okay, we're still in the air. Awesome. Too bad I don't know where anything's at now. Oh, shit. Alright, good. Everything's all scrolled back. Mm-mm. Wow, I can't believe I made that. Don't need that. So this is actually kind of difficult. Oh. I remember this. This is a pretty easy secret. I think there's just a bunch of free lives at the end. I don't know if... Uh, let's see. Oh, aw. I think if you get a 50, you get a 3 a three up. I think you get 3 free lives. I can't remember. Very rarely do I get... 50s, or even tried to get 50s for that matter. Alright, I guess there is a secret for that. I don't know where it brings you. I can't remember. But I don't think it even brings you to a level. I think it just kind of loops you around. Uh, I don't want a flower for this level. Or a uh, feather, I should say. I don't want to fly mistakenly on accident. Okay, never mind. Alright, I guess we're gonna be using the cape now. I could take another hit, but that'd be kinda pointless. Oh, hey, look, that blue switch is coming into some use. Oh, right into the forehead of Mario. Alright, now I have to be a little bit careful. A little bit more than the reckless abandon I've had for the past couple seconds. Come on. Alright. Now those, uh... Those blocks will come in handy here because they'll start blocking out a few of those thwimps. I'm pretty sure. Ah, that was pointless. Alright. Alright, any moment now. Yeah, there we go. Blocks one of the thwimps in. I guess they did a decent job rewarding you, but the 
blue and the red one just kind of suck. They don't really do anything that good. You can't hit them. No power-ups come out of them as far as I know. See, that's the only... Look at that. Makes things a little bit easier. The green ones and the yellow ones are good because they actually give you stuff. Oh. Resnor! Okay. Oh, Resnor! For a lot more walkthroughs like this one, visit GameAnyone.com.